Now this episode we're doing things. Let's go see the Shogi girl. To get better at Shogi, you must practice every day. If you're interested in a lesson, please come to the church. Come on, deepen our bonds, learn how to play Shogi and praise Jesus Christ at the same time. That's so peak. What a downpour. Although my thinking gets sharper on rainy days, it's raining too hard today. The noise is making it hard to focus. Do you remember our promise? You can become my playing partner so long as you can, I can research new moves. In order to do so, I would like you to start off by learning the basics of Shogi. Would you like to play a match? I look forward to it. I'll start. Vanguard of my Togo Kingdom, go forth to the front lines, trample upon them all! What? <laughs> She's really getting into it. You think to protect yourself with that paltry defense? Useless! Awaken, dragon. Let your shadowy hellfire consume them all. Dark Inferno Rook! She's... <laughs> she's quite the oddball, huh? Can you hear them? The wailing of dying soldiers echoing throughout the battlefield? With an incompetent king, a soldier cannot show his true bravery. Time for you to suffer! <laughs> At last, everything is in place. My right hand shrivels as I release my full power. Check. I summon forth the forbidden move that shall bring your in. Ultimate Excalibur attack. Check. She has an active imagination. <sighs> I did it again. It's an embarrassing habit I have. During a match, I um, I tend to get very aggressive. It's as if I assume the role of a queen as a of a kingdom. I like the attitude change. Huh? I myself find it a bit, well... My father had me do image training exercises when I was younger to help me learn the rules. I gradually began to view the shogi board as if it were my own kingdom. I had fun coming up with stories and strategies for my, um, subjects, however. I've heard that people make fun of me on the internet. People think I'm weird or that I'm an otaku or that I'm just crazy. I mean, I can't blame them. Certainly, I think I'm weird too. Uh, I don't worry about them. Yes. Your positivity is a welcome relief. I may be able to learn more from our matches than I thought. If it, if it make you play bet, you a professional shogi player. Titties. You a professional shogi player. If, if doing that make you play better, then do that. What is she drinking? Oh. There's something I wanted to mention. Do you read weekly magazines? Um, well, I'm doing a photo shoot for one. Oh! Seeing her personality, I feel like she wouldn't want to do it. Yep, yeah, you're quite perceptive. I thought you'd be surprised if you saw it on a newsstand, so I wanted to let you know beforehand. In all honesty, I'm very reluctant to do it. But if I could draw more attention to Shogi, maybe this sport would become more popular. At least that's how I'm justifying it to myself. I have an interview scheduled for tonight as well, so let's end here for today. She is not praising the Lord back there. She's napping. Until next time. Well, she, at least she at church. She's doing better than I have recently. Who is on my phone? Yo! I swear. Yusuke, stay out of my crib, bro. Stop coming over. Stop coming over. You pissing me off. Shotty. Thank you. Recent. Thank you. Sorry. My phone's always seems to be acting up. I'm in a good, I think I'm good now, so about the place. It's in Kichicho, you know it? It's in a location. Senpai? Sorry for dragging you out here. I need to get a pair of glasses. I've been wanting to come here for a while, but I never had the chance to drop by. You have bad eyesight? Me, well, a little. 
I usually wear my contacts though. But I'm not looking for a pair for me. I was hoping to find a good gift for my dad. You seem like a real glasses buff, so I wanted to get your advice. Could you try on a couple pairs for me? I'd like to get some visual reference. Thank you so much. How about this pair? Hold on, let me rock it. I think that's good. Is it though? I don't think that looks very good. I'm gonna be honest. What do you think? She's a sweetheart. I don't want to be. I don't. I don't. I, I want to be nice. I'm, I'm a pretty modern look. Yeah. yeah. Make her happy. It's so fashionable and it's good. It's good that it help with your vision too. This could be a good one. Hmm. Do they suit your dad though? That's the question. Why is your face doing that? Oh, the heat wave! I was wondering why I was doing that. It's because of the heat wave. Right, maybe a little too hip for my dad. But your input's been really helpful so far. Would you mind poking around me for a little longer? Sure, whatever. Of course! I'm counting on you. Thank you, this is actually kind of fun. Let's pick up the pace. She's such a sweetheart. I see. You're like a salesman, but it doesn't feel right somehow. Wow. Those definitely have an impression. Heck, people might remember the glasses and nothing else about you. Hold on. I knew it. Hold on. They're like a star right out of Hollywood, but if my dad wore them, he might look a little shady. This is... Why are those even here? I kind of want a pair. Mm. Sorry, I can't decide. A lot of them are good, but none of them has really clenched it for me yet. Come on, trust your instincts. You know you're right. I'm the one who has to make this call. I'm just going off my gut feeling, but I'll pick this pair. I don't know how to describe it. It just seems perfect for my dad somehow. I'm sure he'll love it. Then it's set. Definitely, that's what my gut tells me. What year does Thank you for Persona? Me here. What year does Persona 5 take place? I wonder. Thank you so much for coming here with me today. I ended up with a great present, all thanks to you. I expect compensation. Not a problem. Well, I've still got to make it up to you. Let's go practice in at Ino in Inoka Shira Park after this. Well, if I'm being honest, trying to pick out glasses was really setting off my anxiety. Uh, all I could think of was what happened if I did, couldn't choose or chose the wrong. I mean, I already failed in gymnastics and my cooking turned out bad too. After cracking under pressure so many times, I kind of figured I'd just ruin everything again. The more I thought about it, the more empty I felt. Like I wasn't even me anymore. That's the slump talking! Well, yes, but... Senpai? Hold on. Shut up. I think I'm starting to understand what my coach was telling me. It's easy to say you're in a slump and write yourself off. Maybe finding out who I really am is also finding a, is also about finding new depths to myself. It does make me feel a little down, but at the same time, I feel like I'm closer to getting my confidence back. And having your support makes me even more determined to make that happen. We'll work at it together. <laughs> it's strange. I don't know if I should be feeling like this. I want to give my best performance, but it's like I'd be doing it for you as much as for myself or something like that. Hold on. I'm still working on myself, but I hope we can keep helping each other out, too. Ambush from a distance by attacking with the grappling. All right. Hold on. Ambush from a distance by attacking with the grappling. We finna get to grappling. You know what's happening. Hold on. That's kind of hard. Now we should get the training. Maybe we can try some intermediate level exercises today. All right. I'll be heading home now. 
Bye bye! Are you able to talk right now? So I gave my dad the glasses we picked out today, and it suits him even better than I imagined. He was so happy with them. I'm glad to hear that. Thank you. I think this helped me feel a little more confident. Thanks to you, I, I even feel like my gymnastics are going to go better now. I'm sick of wasting my time worrying. Whatever I'm up against, I'm just going to give it my best shot. My actions always speak louder than words, right? I'll prove I'm not all talk. I better go. I hope we can talk again later. What did I say a, a few episodes ago? I was like, when, when she was first talking about it, I was like, the issue... Man, it's hot. Shut up. I said it. Like, the, the main issue is the fact that you think there's an issue. You feel me? Like, sometimes when you're actively thinking about a problem you have, that causes the problem to become even more, like, become even bigger and more difficult to, you know, manage. Okay, today we're going to try brewing a cup of coffee from step one. Just listen to what I tell you. These beans are Colombian, a medium fine city roast. Oh, and don't let the water boil too much. You're gonna be fine. I'll be here the whole time. It sucks! Yeah. Not bad. Though I guess anyone can do something as simple as just brewing it. Making a blend, on the other hand, is a different story. Mixing beans at random won't do you any good. That's because the acidity and flavor profile all depend on the bean ratio. Pretty deep, huh? Tell me more. Oh, someone's enthusiastic. If you're really that interested, feel free to try whatever combinations you want to. Oh, but hands off the expensive beans, got it? Next up is the curry. There's something special about its flavor. The truth is, a scientific genius actually came up with the perfect spice combo to complement my coffee. Something about the quantification of taste. There's no formula for flavor, but it is pretty damn good. Anyhow, we don't make compromises when it comes to food service. Our stuff's gotta wow the customers. This is a tiny shop after all. Self-satisfaction is the only thing that keeps me going. You. <clears throat> Haven't I told you? Haven't I already told you I don't have the money? Look at this place. You see many customers in here? Oh, no need to hide it, Sakura-san. You must have had you must have saved plenty of money from your time working in the government. Aren't you taking care of that employee right there, too? For nothing more than charity? I wish you'd show me the same kindness you show others. <sighs> if you're not planning on buying anything, can you please leave? I'm expecting a phone call so I don't have time to chat with you. I don't mind if you take the car right in front of me. I could talk to your little friend here in the meantime. Or should we keep talking until your call comes? Or would that be too inconvenient for you? Well... Was in trouble. What should I do? Can I just kick the man out? Hold on. Let's be cunning with it. Let's be cunning with it. Oh, there's that call. That's that social services call I was waiting for. They sure come around pretty often to make sure this guy's not getting any trouble. Want me to introduce you? Oh, that's right. I have some business I need to take care of myself. I'll come back later. Jeez. Does he really have nothing better to do? I guess I should explain what's going on. He might try to drop by when I'm not around. That man is an old acquaintance of mine who's short on cash right now. Looks pretty friendly, yeah? Don't let him fool you. It's all an act. I have to say, though, I'm surprised you were quick-witted enough to pull that stuff off. You really saved me back there. Thanks. You already know how I roll. You already know All right. how I go. Basis of LeBlanc curry. I can make curry. Ooh. Why do you poke around in other people's troubles? It's way easier to ignore them. I guess that's just the kind of person you are though, huh? Is that time already? I'd report him to the cops if you weren't related to her. Oh, never mind no, that. Anyway, that's it for today. Go study or something after you close up.
Ouch. Ooh. Hey. Sorry about today. Didn't mean to get you wrapped up in my problems. I probably don't have to say it, but if that guy shows up while I'm out, just try to ignore him, okay? Just let him do his thing and get on with the job. Got it? Understood. Good. Whatever he says, just don't let it get to you. You're still under probation, so don't cause a scene, yeah? I'm trusting you on this. Later. Aw, oh, he's trusting us. Ton of info leaks. Not med yet. They make it into a much more theatrical occasion. Getting declarations. Headache. We're, they're getting online is insane. People are treating us like it's our fault. If we don't hurry and take care of this. I mean, we've already taken care of it, more or less. Really, we just need freaking Futaba to wake up. There's a movie I want to see. I'll be leaving soon if you'd care to join me. Le Miserable. Miserable. Uh, however you say it in French. Remake of a classic. Apparently it came out this summer. What do you think? Sure, why not? It'll probably increase charm. Sounds like a romance. It was him. He stole the silverware. He even stole the candlesticks. Thief. Confess your crime. Oh, is there no God in this world? That bishop guy is too much to cut the other guy some slack. Kindness. <laughs> the amount of artistry and effort they put into the stage set is truly astounding. Forgive me, I can't help but focus more on the visual aspect than on the storyline. I don't mind. Indeed. Well... I already understand that you're not the type to feel offended by such matters. I'm in your debt. Thank you for today. The time we spent together felt worthwhile. Well, then let's head home. Oh, snap. It was on. Why not? Let's go. I'm just like, bro. Oh, getting so frustrated. Yusuke and Ryuji wouldn't leave me alone. I just thought it was going to be one of them again. It was on. Hey. You know how people, go to, people will pray before filming movies so that it'll go smoothly? Should we try praying to the gods too? What do you mean by that? Oh, don't get the wrong idea. I'm in us like the Phantom Thieves. I don't really know how to pray properly. What should I do? Maybe I'll ask someone. Hey, I don't know how y'all... Is that Takemi? Can I ask you a question? Is that so? What a surprise seeing you in a place like this. Are you on a date? It's such an odd location for someone your age. And you? Minor business, I guess. Uh, is this someone you know? Don't worry about me. I don't intend to intrude. That's my goat. Oh. Oh, I assume you're here for your college entrance exams. You had mentioned them before. Shake the bell twice and put in your offering, then bow twice, clap twice, and bow once again. Wasn't that what you wanted to ask? You're amazing, Doc. Whoa! That must have been three to each. Wait, you're a doctor? Well, you really helped us out. Thank you very much. Sure, although you may want to use this time to actually study for the exams instead of praying. Exams? Wait, I think I recognize her. Right. That's the doctor who gets us our medicine. Oh, I see. Wait, you've been here the whole time? How rude. I'm here to protect. Shut up. Praying about college entrance yep. exams. We asked earlier. We asked earlier she could get us some of her super stimulants to help us study. I see. 
Wouldn't the gods be mad to get a visit from a cheater? Let's get back. I'm about to say, like, I don't know how y'all Japanese pray, but you know, I just I get on my knees for the Lord. Man, it's hot. Oh, we got break. We got break. Mm -hmm. Let's talk about Aiko. Aiko Niwa. Actually, apparently Aiko has started dating a host from a club near her work. I guess he um hit on her one day after her shift, and that was that. Since then, he's the only thing she'll be talking about. She even sent me a picture of their date at this Destiny Land. A host. I don't. Yeah. You think so as well. For now, it seems he hasn't forced her to spend any money at his club, but I'm still nervous. Beyond that, he calls her his princess and constantly tells her how special she is. It makes me sick to my stomach. <sighs> she refuses to listen to me. She said the idea that all hosts are bad people is outdated. She even said she was shocked to be getting advice from someone who would totally flunk a test about love. Huh. I wouldn't want advice from you either. Tests about love aren't a thing though. And even if they were, I would most certainly wouldn't flunk them. No, you would, you would, you would. Hate to say it, you would. Sorry about that. I'm probably just being biased towards him. I mean, I don't have any proof that he's untrustworthy. But that's why I want to meet him and find out for myself what kind of person he really is. And if it's too much to ask, if it's not too much to ask, I'd like you to accompany me on this excursion as well. Uh, well... This time, you'll have to play the role of my boyfriend. Only if I can take it seriously. Hold on. Hmm? How do you mean? <laughs> oh, I see. You're seriously worried about Aiko too. Yeah, that's what I mean. That's very kind of you. Think if I have a boyfriend, Aiko might be more inclined to actually... listen. Actually... Tell the truth, I actually already made plans with her and her boyfriend for a double date. Sorry. But it's just gonna be at a diner. Nothing particularly fancy, I promise. Yeah, I can't... Thank you. I don't, I don't have money, so... I mean, I do got... I got like 30 racks on me right now. Hold on, I got... Big pockets. Big pockets. Pockets so big it's making my pants... Hold on. Big pockets. Pockets big, making my pants falling, pants dropping. Finna go up with them bands, pockets, bands, pockets. Oh, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. I can't, hold on, I can spit that. My fault. I'm so glad you agreed to this. I don't know what I'd do. I don't know who else I'd have asked if you said no. There's no one else for you to ask. All right. Don't lick your lips at the screen. <laughs> I just hope she's not getting herself wrapped up in anything dangerous. But just in case, I'll try looking for some info on that host. All right. Then. I just hope that host is is younger than 18 years old and not a grown man. That's what I hope. I just hope that host isn't a grown man. <laughs> that that's my worry. That I had to ask something so unreasonable. I appreciate you going along with it, though. Do you think Aiko's really okay? I hope I'm just being paranoid. What if it turns out he really is toying with her? What should we do? Fist him! Out of question, we'd end up arrested for assault. You of all people need to be careful about that. You're under probation. I keep thinking in circles here. I need to stop dwelling on the negative. Let's see who the host is behind this... Smile for Aiko's sake. I'll call you later. The world would be a better place if we could just fist Man, everybody that, that we think is evil. Man, it's so it's hot. hot. Even the fandom is hoping you guys can fix this heat somehow. They should know that you're the fan of Deverse, not Phantom Weatherman. Oh, so you did the request I asked you to do, thanks. I'd like to talk to you today about how I'm helping you guys. Do you have time? Come on, let's get going. Sorry. Oh, Lord. That was from Akiyama. He said he wants me to stop by. Apparently, it's pretty close. It's not as serious. I don't think we should ignore him. Can you come with? Oh. Akiyama? Mishima, 
Ah, there's our guy. Look, Akiyama says he's not going to be able to pay up this month. How about you spot him? That's what friends are for, right? Friends? Oh, you guys ain't friends? Don't try and mess with us, Akiyama. Is this loser supposed to be the friend who's going to help you? If you don't got anything to do with this little bitch, Akiyama, I suggest you get out of here. Come on, Taro. Looks like we're going to have to go have a nice chat with that girlfriend of his. Please, no, I'm begging you. Sorry, but you broke our promise. Now she's going to be the one to pay us back if you catch my drift. <laughs> Ew! Why did bro do that with his tongue? That's what you give for trying to screw us over. <sighs> Excuse me. What the, what what you gonna do? <laughs> I'm not sure. I can't just abandon him though. They got an idea. It's risky, but it might just work. If anything happens, take care of him, okay? <gasps> hey, you guys! Ah, uh, ah, uh, bit my tongue. Ah, uh, you're still here? Run away, you idiot! Y you'd better lay off, Akiyama! I've been taking a video this whole conversation! Huh? You do anything to his, him and his girlfriend, I'll bring it straight to the police! And don't take any ideas about breaking my phone! I, it backs up to this cloud automatically! Hey, what should we do? We'll be fine. The police ain't gonna do shit because of a stupid little video. Why don't you run along home to your anime girls? We don't got time to deal with losers like you. <sighs> you just gonna take that, bro? You just gonna take that? If you don't lock in... <laughs> what the hell? Look, I know you guys are supposed to be tough and all, but are you sure it's really worth getting arrested again over something like this? You're gonna get in the crook. You guys busted, given your previous criminal records. How'd you know about that? Doesn't matter how, just leave Akiyama alone and we'll be even. Then if you keep your word, I'll delete the video, the backup too. You'll delete them now. No. Uh, Yura. Had enough of this shit. Fuck this motherfucker. What the fuck talking about? Beat the fuck out of this motherfucker. Beat the fuck out of this ugly ass nigga. Fuck out of bitch. Man, I thought I was gonna have a heart attack. My whole act would have broken down if they didn't back off when they did. I suck. Hey, bro, you were chill. You were cool. Hmm? You think? I... Uh, all right, Yuka. The truth is, I've dealt with enough bullying to know guys like that have probably been arrested at least once. <laughs> Oh, and thanks for sticking by me. We can't let injustice like that go to go unchecked. I think I get it now. This feeling is what made me want to help you guys to begin with. Why I started the fan? You're talking loud next to somebody who does not know what's going on. No skill? This nigga sucks. All right. <sighs> Akiyama, are you okay? It, it looks like they really laid it on you. Mishima, why'd you help me? Huh? You didn't need to get involved. Sorry. It looked like you were really in trouble though, so I stepped up. Is that so? Anyway, can you walk? Do you need us to call an ambulance? I'm fine, just go. Oh. Well, see you later. Guy like me, I be licking my balls. No, I don't do that. Sorry, you okay to talk right now? Panic is finally kicking in. I'm shaking so bad, I need to talk to someone. Hey, you think I'll be okay? What if those guys secretly followed me home? Uh-oh, but I have a model gun I got for self-defense. My security system top of the line, so I'm safe, right? You'll be fine. Where does all that confidence come from? I do feel a little calmer now that I got to talk to you about it. I'm so exhausted. Wish I could just crash, but I've got to do some research on these guys. I have to mop the fan site too. It's looking, it's looking like another all-nighter. Who the fuck? <sighs> Who could it be at this hour? 
<laughs> Went to see Shiha again the other day. I've been thinking a lot since then, though. Do you have time to talk? Thanks. Um. So I talked to Shiha about what happened with Mika back at the photo shoot. You know what she did? Laughed. She couldn't stop thinking about how tough, how tough she thought Mika sounded. Honestly, though, it's kind of refreshing. I'm not even mad anymore. I guess you really need someone to laugh at you when you want to feel better. If it's a friend, yeah. I wouldn't want strangers to just start laughing at me. You're probably right about that. It'd probably make me even angrier if it was some random person. But anyway, even though I'm trying to strengthen my heart, she holds a real strong one here. Hey. I went to one of her rehab sessions the other day. She said she wanted me to be there. She agreed, right, so I agreed without thinking much of it. But it ended up being pretty under overwhelming. Was she working hard? Yeah. She was dripping with sweat, teeth clenched. She was clearly in a lot of pain. Apparently she can't even move her feet. She said it feels like her legs are filled with sand. But she dragged them along, legs swollen with blood. I just wanted I just I wanted to just make her stop. <sighs> By the time it was all over, she was in tears. It was really tough on her. She said she wanted to give up. And that's why she asked me to come to keep her motivated. The whole time she was complaining about things in a way she normally never would. But even with that, she finished her session. I don't even know why I'm crying. I didn't have to go through that. Is it because I'm weak? It's because you're kind. You're wrong. Oh, fuck you, bitch! Damn! <laughs> Bro! Fuck you! Because you're kind. You're wrong. Alright, you're mean! You're a terrible person! Dang! Some of you are trying to be nice! You know, even though I went through all that pain, I thought Shiho was so cool. Beautiful, even. Despite all her complaining, she still tried incredibly hard. Strength is more than just not getting phased. It's the power to fight through adversity. <sighs> so I was thinking, and um, what can I do to help Shiho? Show her your own strength. My strength? Yeah. I'll do just that. I'm going to give it my all. Being with you really helps me see things clearly. What should I do? The true meaning of Thanks. strength. Thank you for that. All right. Oh, my nose is all runny. What are you looking at me like that for? Pretty girls get runny noses too, you know. Oh, it's me. Thanks for earlier. I feel bad now that I got to talk to you about everything. I'm gonna try my best to help Shiho out in my own way. Maybe our relationship won't ever be how exactly how it was before. But now that I saw her crying, I know I'll do something. I, there's, I know I'll find something I can do for her. I'll cheer you on. I can't let her leave me behind. One day I'll be cool and strong, just like Shiho. I feel great now that I got everything off my chest. You're a great listener. Talking to someone, she seems troubled. Let's talk to the girl. Thank you for shaking my hand. I'm never gonna wash it. Huh? Uh-huh, um, please wash it. Can't believe that you're really here in a church. I read on the internet that you pray to the God for pray to God for victory, is that true? No. Can I take a selfie with you? I posted online. Sorry, I've been turning down all such requests. By the way, is it true that you're trying to become a professional shogi player? Well, nothing's been. I'll be cheering for. I'll be cheering for you to qualify. You'll be the first woman to surpass a third Donna League. I really believe in you. Thank you very much. Good evening. 
Men like that men like that approach me all the time. At first I thought you were one of them. I really must apologize for being rude to you. Um it bothers me when people make such a big fuss over me, considering that the priest is doing me a great favor by letting me play here. You see, he's my shogi friend. He's very kind. He once told me he wanted to become a professional player. And he doesn't laugh at my embarrassing habit when we play together. Oh. So, I did the photo shoot. I'm embarrassed just thinking about it. Did you see it? It was called the Venus of Shogi. That's... That's quite the headline. That's quite the headline. It certainly is. It's not really an excuse, but the editorial staff came up with that title on their own. Okay, I feel like I have a, a, a glimpse. I, ha I feel like I have a grasp of it. Things like that, I should have said it fits you perfectly. I gotta, I, I gotta play into the the little Chuni Bio thing she likes to do. Because I gotta play into the little Chuni Bio thing and show that I don't find it weird. And I also gotta like, you know, just be really calm and cool with her. That's what I think. Ever since I won the female Shogi League, I've been getting a lot of attention. I figured I could contribute to the Shogi world besides, my mother seems to be very happy. Whenever I win, she rejoices as if it were her own victory. <sighs> so I want to live up to the expectations she has for me. However, she's been a bit overzealous lately. She set up the interview and photo shoot. It's as if she wants to be the manager of a celebrity. Having a difficult time? A bit. But it's fine because it's for my mother. Sorry. I should be teaching you how to play instead of talking about my mom's. Hold on. She don't talk like that. Today I'll be showing you something very practical. It's a tactic for using the reserved pawns you've taken from an, your opponent in a more effective way. Nevertheless, I apologize. You're such a good listener. I feel at ease speaking with actually. you. Actually. Aside from the priest, you're actually the first person I've spoken to about my mother. Uchi Komi. All right. I will instruct you while I we look play. Forward to it. Are you ready? All right. So far, her Makoto and Takemi are my favorite female characters. You feel me? They're my favorite female character. I think I'm a ha. Huh. I think I'm a romance Makoto, unless somebody else pu pulls up. I would do to Kimmy, but my goat doesn't like children, so like my, my goat isn't interested in high schoolers, so I'm, I, I, you know, I'm not gonna, I'm not, I, I don't know about everybody else playthrough, but in my playthrough, the goat to Kimmy is not interested in high schoolers, so I'm not romancing her. Until next time. Though I personally wouldn't mind if she was like trying to get at your boy, but you know. <laughs> She, 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 she better than that. Uh, this is Hifumi. I appreciate you spending time with me today. I ended up feeling much better after sharing my concerns with you. But this hardly seems fair. How can I teach you properly when I'm this distressed? Bring it on! Oh, are you sure? You really are a strange individual, but thank you for the encouragement. If that's the case, I can only hope to repay you through my lessons. You make for a refreshing opponent. Somehow the more we exchange, the more I feel my world expanding. Teaching you is also a great learning experience for me, as it leads to a deeper understanding of myself. Well then, if you'll excuse me, I'll see you for our next match. I really like her. She's so cool. She's cool. Opera could be same height as me, laying eye to eye. If the combo ain't no bind a profit, then it's high and by. <sighs> I'm about sick of these freaking requirements. Will my charm go up if I just started shooting people? It's really sunny today, so be sure to stay hydrated. I'm thinking of doing a different kind of training than usual. What do you think? Do you have time to try it out right now? <laughs> Batting cages. Alright, let's hit some balls. Um. Probably didn't expect to be meeting me at the batting center, huh? What are you scheming? You have to look so concerned. We're only at a batting cage. 
Batting helps train your reflexes and dynamic vision. It also strengthens your stance. And really, those are important elements in gymnastics too. It all sounds pretty plausible, right? Actually, I just wanted to come here. Honestly, I wanted you to see me hit a home run. Seems kind of sudden. <laughs> Remember something from when I was little. My father used to take me to the batting cages a lot. The other kids were scared of getting hit by the baseballs, but I just loved swinging the bat around. Every time I hit one, I kept thinking, doesn't matter how fast they y'all, slam them in the orbit. I thought if I put myself back in that headspace, I could get some ideas on how to get my boldness back. What do you think, that could work? It's a good idea. Yes. Right, I think it'll really help. My turn. Next up to the play, Kasumi Yoshizawa. Here I go. Come on, hit it. Now come on. That stance is diabolical. W were they always this fast? I'll get the next one. You are trash. It's the next one that counts. No more warm-ups. From now on, it's going to be 100% home runs. I'm sorry. I knew I was rusty, but I didn't expect to miss all of them. I never see the ball coming. I just and I keep flinching. I didn't think my slump was hitting me this hard. You can beat this, right? You're right, I'll give it one more shot. That stance is crazy. Stay calm, don't be scared. Eyes on the ball. My turn. Come on. Uh. I did it! I did it! I hit the ball! I saw! I knew you were watching. That's how I did my best. Up until now, I've only been working for myself. I was so desperate to make a good impression. Since I started hanging out with you, I, I started feeling like I wanted to live up to your expectations. And that feeling's helped me feel so much stronger. I've forgotten how it felt to work that hard on someone else's behalf. Don't forget how that feels. Yes! Right, of course. I've been discovering so many new things since I met you. I feel like I'm closer than ever to getting my confidence back. Please, listen to me. I've been feeling a lot more limber and energized lately too. And I'm totally back to normal. I'm not totally back to normal yet. But even my grades have been going back up. Nicely done. Thank you very much. I still need to show you what I can do. Next time you won't have to watch me fumbling with the bat, I'll show you an all new full power gymnastics routine. I am the this union. Born and embraced by will unyielding, shall become the balefire that lights thy path. Thou hast gained a glimpse of the faith's truth, granting thee further power to tread the abyss. Huh? All right. We've still got a lot to hit, I think it's short turn. Give it all the guts you've got, smash it in outer space. Good effort. I don't get like an ultimate faith persona. Thank you for thank you so much for coming with me today. I haven't swung a bat in a while. My arms still feel kinda weird. I was kind of hoping to knock it out with a clang, but I'm just happy I managed to hit the ball. It's nice to dip into sports aside from gymnastics. Was there anything you wanted to try? Gymnastics? <laughs> really? I'm so happy you're interested in gymnastics. Men's rhythmic, rhythmic gymnastics actually originated in Japan. You need a ton of power and speed to compete in those. But I see you have the potential to do well in it. I love to see. I love to see you try some acrobatic moves. I have a request for you. May I ask you to join me for more things from now on? When I'm with you, I just feel so much more capable. Whether you want to go train again or just hang out and chat, please reach out whenever. Reach out to the truth. You gotta be the moons that's reaching out stars. The clans are fast approaching. Talking about leaks everywhere I go. The noose is tightening around our necks. Futaba will save us. I have my hope, but isn't it dangerous to put all our eggs in that one basket? 
Timmy Grace is that man Jen and seen the Tina take it to their planned date. Try. Yusuke, get your homeless ass away from my house! Damn! Y'all ever get excited and just start blowing everywhere? Legend of Gambla. Hmm. Hmm. Notorious thief who fell into the depths oh. of hell. Okay, is that a demon? What is this, Undertale? Beat this demon at a dice game. You have to choose either even or odd. Okay, I know even and odd. Even. You will win if your number is even. Fuck. Even. Fuck! Let's go with odd. Yes! I did not mean to skip all that. Gone and the gates open up. You can move onward now. Okay. Come and manage to clear the stage. Love that attitude you had to persistence is cool. Ah! Come on! Give it to me! Just give it to me! Oh my goodness! Hold on, that's eight! Okay, it all comes down to this. You fucking bitch! Oh man. Oh my god, I can't! I can't! I can't do this! Get off my phone! Oh, Makoto. Even. Let's go! Alright, we got the first one. I. I. Fuck! One more week to the graduation, see the form, people are telling us to hurry up. Saying what they want with no regard to the consequences. I cannot believe people are still going on. I can't believe pe they're going on about all of or all going up. How's Futaba? That's for her assistance. She's working on it. Oh. Look, I don't care about any of that. I need to get this going. Come on. Come on. Let's go. All right, we got the first one. Yeah. Onto the third or final round. What does it matter? Hold on, we got all three. We got oh. three out of three. Yes. Won the bet. You won? It seems as though your fate has not yet come to an end. The world of living is nothing but suffering. I hope you have the strength to survive it. Yes. Okay. Clear the stage. <laughs> yeah. Yeah! All right. Hey. I'm thinking of resigning. What? Several of my suppliers have stated that they're gonna stop selling to me. If I can't get my hands on medical supplies, I won't be able to get what I need to complete the new medicine. They're probably being pressured by Oma Oyamada to stop doing business with me, so I figure it's over. You okay? What about Miwa? It's fine. I confirmed with the hospital that she's being treated at. Oyamada was telling the truth. Miwa wasn't was apparently smiling until the very end. She probably didn't want to worry anyone. I wish I could have cured her. I didn't want fame or money. All I wanted was to keep her smiling. This isn't just about her though. <laughs> I was gonna help every single person who was suffering from that disease. Same here. I was a sickly child when I was young too. I was always in a hospital and was rarely well enough to attend school at all. Medicine was all that kept me alive. 
That's why I wanted to become a doctor. So I could save people just like I was saved. <sighs> but I guess this is where it ends. The medical industry is a business after all, and the chief decides what's best for it. I'm all out of allies. Come on, I'm your ally! I, I don't, I mean, that probably doesn't, probably doesn't count for much, but, you know, I'm still here. Yeah, you're right. You might just be my one and only ally. I really appreciate everything you've done. My practice increased thanks to your nosiness, and in the end, I felt like a real doctor again. So thank you. You gonna run away? I just might. This is where it ends, although it frustrates me. I can't do clinical trials anymore, Thanks. so you can go home. Thanks again for all your help, and good luck on those interest exams. Bye. Hold on. What's his full name? What are you trying to do? You mean Oyamata? Why? I hope you're not planning to get revenge for me. I won't do anything. I promise. You're such a weird kid. Shoichi Oyamata. He's very influential chief of staff in the world of medicine. Is that all? Take care. <laughs> I'm gonna kill this nigga. Can't stop, won't stop. I just chose to shine and shine, shine, tank top. Back to the part-time jobs. Y'all know the drill. Nice to meet you. Megumi Hanasaki, owner of the shop. I do everything my I will do everything myself today, so you can just observe me and try to Good learn luck. the ropes. Hey! Apron suits you. Yeah, it does. I look good in everything. Here. You did great. A smooth three K. I ain't talking Andre. How are you feeling? Hold on. Hmm. Want to head back? Back on top, punching the clock, clutch of sanity. It got more crib than habitat for humanity. Uh, Profound, propagating more profanity. Paying up collections for recollections of calamity. I didn't explain things to you last time. Let's see. We have our happy flower days on Wednesday and Saturdays. We offer discounts on bouquets. I'll be having you choose the flowers for the bouquets. I might even bump up your pay if the customer really likes your arrangement. I know today isn't a happy flower day, but we do have a bouquet request. It's important that you get some practice. I appreciate it. Order for a bouquet, please handle it. Large, brightly colored flowers. Pick three that fit that description. Okay. Hmm. Large, brightly colored flowers. I bet light colors or white would even work too. Uh, large, brightly colored. A large white flower. A large pink flower. A large yellow flower. What do you want to do? Large, brightly colored flowers. Yes, this is perfect. Hey, hey. Hope the customer likes it. I picked three large, brightly colored flowers. She better like it. What a relief. They brought the bouquet without any complaints. I guess that's a pretty standard reaction. <laughs> If you want to know more about our flowers, I suggest you read the Flowerpedia. I'm not doing all that. Here. I don't care about flowers. Yeah, give me my money. I'm here for a paycheck. You did great. How are you feeling? Work hard today. Hmm. We need some more work. Wanna oh my back? goodness! Just give me the dang information already. So that's a shot of that doctor, Oyamata. That <sighs> bastard like you've been eating well lately. He made a mistake in rushing a drug's development and now it intends for his subordinate to take the fall. What a jerk! People might die if we don't change his heart, and a good doctor will have to quit. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone's trash! 
As head of the medical office, I'm superior to everyone. I deserve all your respect. You should be begging me to examine you. Be grateful I have the compassion to fix you trash. Give it up. You're that kid who was at Takemi, so how she's doing? She was so depressed when she heard her patient died. Oh, I'm so worried about her poor girl. <laughs> it's been so long since I felt so exhilarated. Did she quit being a doctor yet? If she had it, then tell her she better hurry it up. I'll, I'll let her. Never forgive you. Come get this penis, little nigga. Bro, it's a monkey! This is my other self. Die! Give me a break. Vital signs diminishing. Thank God. Oh, what have I done? How come I'm not good enough? I want to save people's lives and I want to do something great. I can help make medical history. But I'm just a mediocre doctor. I've only gotten promoted because of my university connections. Takemi, though, was so creative. She had all these ideas and her techniques were extraordinary. Everything I ever wanted, fame, prestige, she earned in just a few short years. I was jealous of her. That's why I tried to take all the credit for her new drug. There had to be another way, man. If only there was a medication to treat jealousy. Takemi's patient isn't dead. I thought she wouldn't recover, so I moved her to the hospital. Of course, transferring to another hospital makes our own hospital and university look really bad. That's why I made everyone tell the same lie. The patient chose to leave the hospice and then died. She doesn't have much time left, but maybe Takemi can do something about it. Meteorama. Hmm. Uh, uh, can't stop, won't stop. Oh, it would seem. I see you brought us a tinta with Raku Kaja. See? You can Not do bad. it. Not bad, that's another one done. <laughs> you know, I never thought you'd keep at this even though it's not mandatory. You're pretty interesting, inmate. <sighs> I must say, as Caroline noted before, this list is quite well thought out. The tasks are designed to push you toward achieving your goals while also measuring your true strength. I guess so. Hey, inmate! Hey, inmate, what are your thoughts on these tasks? They're pretty tough. Such a response is proof that they are the proper difficulty. <sighs> oh well, we should just give them the next one. Let's see here. Huh? What the? It feels like I've seen the writing on this list before. Do you speak of the penmanship? Uh, I can't remember. Do you recognize it, Justine? Compliment him after he finishes the next task. Don't spoil him, though. Do it just like you practice with the piercing glare and angled hips. Wait, not that. Those are my notes. I, uh, no, I mean... <laughs> Goober. You've been rather looking forward to the inmates' visits. Never mind that. I'm talking about the handwriting of the tasks themselves. Stop yanking my chain. I do feel as though I've seen that handwriting somewhere before. Can I see? Excuse me? <laughs> Keep your nose out of other people's business, inmate! <sighs> to be honest, the sense of deja vu I feel when reading this list is certainly concerning to me. Who made this list and why? What do you mean? It goes pretty obvious. It's how I've the inmate. Beyond that, though, wh what exactly is the purpose of training him? Rehabilitation? But that is merely our master's order. Someone other than him wrote this list, correct? assume there's some purpose we don't know about if we're right in our assumption the purpose will be clear once he finishes the whole list right that is correct hearing something logical from you is like a cool rush of air and mr. sweltering heat in the summer hmm. now then let us reward you create personas you wouldn't normally to the fullest
All right. If you can try three times before you can receive it. Task number one. Now. Neko Shogun with Dekaja. A Neko Shogun with Dekaja? You s I think I have a Neko Shogun. Ataba, worried about her. This ain't just some normal oversleeping stuff. Our deadline's tomorrow. Vertuba's not up by then. But can't she really do anything even if she does wake up? Our only option is to put our trust in her. And she's been asleep all this time. Do you think she's having some kind of long dream? Sorting memories. She surely needs ample time to face her troubled past. If that's the case, she will probably need a great amount of more time to do that. I believe in her. I have to agree with Makoto. Who knows how this might turn out? I do. Considering the fact that I'm playing the game, you know, like the game would be over like now if this didn't turn out good. So as far as I know, y'all are just complaining. Oh. Okay. Star Fornius. Space battles, you're blasting away the enemy ships one after another, not bad for a beginner. Hey, wait! That thing must be huge. Yeah! Let's get it. Nice! Hey! Managed to beat the level, I'm impressed. <laughs> what can I say? I'm gonna go. I can't help being the best. I can't help being the best at everything I do. I can't help it, you know? The other day, man jet attacking. Guess there's nothing what the fan of these could do. Oh, I thought I saw something. Man jet must have been too much for them. Oh, shot. Isn't today our deadline for dealing with Medjet? We'll be fine. Futaba's still asleep, too. This won't be good. Hey. What's up? There's something I came to do. Today's the day Wakaba passed. I do this every year. Here, I've got a cup for you too. Oh my goodness, my arm is tight. Futaba reminds me so much of her mother. She's a smart girl. Doesn't just go with the flow either. Wakaba, your work and your kid were so fulfilling for you. Why'd you have to die so suddenly? Dang, man. That reminds me. You saw me talking to that prosecutor. I, I mean, that woman in the suit, right? I remember you were real bothered by it. She might come back, so I guess I should tell you about it. That woman was trying to get information on Wakaba's research out of me. That's what we heard in the palace. You don't need to know what the research was about. Just know there was some trouble around it. Obviously, Wakaba got dragged into that as well. Now, they ruled her death as suicide. But I've got my doubts. Doubts? Could she have been killed? Mm. Supposedly, there were people who wanted to take her research and use it for their own benefit. Research, okay. Don't get me wrong, though. I don't have a lick of evidence. That's why I haven't told Futaba any of this. I don't want to cause her any more trouble. It sounded like she had suspicions of her own based on what she said in the palace. Still, there's one thing I regret. It was right before Wakaba died. She told me, I think I might die. I brushed it off thinking it was just a joke. But if I had just taken her seriously... <sighs> Dang, man. That's another reason I took Futaba in. Redemption. She went through such horrible things. Those heartless adults just yelled at the poor girl. Hey, how do you heal emotional scars? They heal on their own, I guess. I agree. I don't know. I'm waiting for it to happen, but... 
Futaba? Yeah, hold on, that's the girl. Oh, she kind of fitted up though. She got that on. It's cold. She got that on. Uh, uh, huh? You can't sell this. N never mind that. But how did you get here? She got that on. Uh, I walked. You're okay? Was that bad? Th that's not it. I'm just shocked to see you out of the house. Uh, I'm sorry I worried you. <laughs> it's all right. But I miss you. By the way, what's the date today? Uh, it's, uh, it's the 21st. I feel like I'm forgetting something. Our deal! Our deal! We waited for you! Oh, I remember now. Majed. Let's take care of it now. Come. Yeah. Come on. Let's go. Boy, are we lucky. <laughs> I thought she spent all this time waiting. I mean, taking care of it. I ain't know she was just knocked out the whole time. It's my turn to help out. <laughs> Majed. Now, how do we cook them? Eliminate them! Huh. Violent much? I want them dead! Futaba, we don't have much time left. Are you sure you could do this? The, the kitty talked? Is this a dream? I'm going back to sleep. It is not a dream! Get up! Say something! I'll explain later. Just get to work! R right. Now hurry it up! Eh, I guess it doesn't matter. Let's get cracking. You're just tapping away over there. Are you sure this will work? Morgana, shut up! Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hey, Futaba! Shut up! Let it work! I don't think she can hear me. Talk about intense concentration. This place is so messy. I'm surprised she could focus at all. Utaba, you should really clean your room a bit. Bro, let her work! <laughs> Shut up! She's not listening. Oh well. Just waiting around is boring. Let's clean the place up. Whew. It looks a little better now, don't you think? Well, Futaba, we're done on our end. Are you finished yet? <laughs> Stop rushing her, bro. Let her she work. Can't hear a word I'm saying. You are uh, annoying. Guess we'll just have to keep waiting. <sighs> I'm done. Uh, what's up? Something happened? It's finished. Finished? What is? Uh, it's so clean. Why? We cleaned it. Anyway, is it true? Did you really take care of Medjed? I handled them, and someone else handled my room. I don't understand, but this is good. Utaba? Now she's hey, sleeping. Futaba, what's okay. Wrong? <sighs> she's sleeping. Well, it looks like it's been taken care of. I guess we should get home and sleep too. Top is awake, awesome. And has Medjet been taken care of? Or more importantly, how's she doing? She's back asleep. Must have been quite exhausted. I can't say I blame her at all. Medjet has been affected, it will surely make the news. That should confirm whether or not the deed's been done. Watch the news all together, meet up at LeBlanc. We should be in the clear now, right? Be better we stayed in today. Looks like I don't have a choice. Okay. I'm a shapeshifter! That pose master. Oh. 
okay. Aim carefully before you shoot it down. Hmm? Our enemy's Jesus. a boss. Come on, come on, come on, come on! I'm gonna go! Yes! Hey! Beat the level, I'm impressed. What, you ain't think I could do it? What's this? Serious? No way, I can't believe it. This is a joke, right? They lost, how could this happen? Hey, your friends are here. Hurry down. What's up? So you're finally up, huh? Hey, don't slack off just because you're on summer vacation. Yo, you look tired. I am tired. We've made ourselves at home. Dear Lord. Late last night, it was discovered that someone has tampered with the hacker group Medjid's website. The site's main page now displays what is thought to be the mark belonging to the Phantom Thieves. More so, the personal information of a Japanese man, a possible Medjid member, was illegally publicized. Aren't these the guys people have been up in arms about? Medjid has yet to issue an official reply. Furthermore, their previously announced cleanse of Japan has remained unimplemented for now. Some speculate that they have taken this series of events seriously and ultimately canceled their plan. Yeah. <laughs> yes. They couldn't handle us. What are you all smirking about? Nothing. Well, stop it. You're gonna drive away all my customers. Your customers don't After like happy children. Break, we will be asking guests from various fields about this turn of events. But there ain't any customers. Can it? My customers are on summer vacation too. <laughs> Oh crap, I just realized our break's almost over. There are still 10 days left. I want to go somewhere, but we can't just leave Futaba-chan alone. Some things still concern me too. Like that research. Y'all finally learn how to whisper, bro. Oh, did you just get up? Good morning. <gasps> it seems she's cautious of us. Hey, uh, why don't we go upstairs? If any customers come, she'll be even more afraid. Why don't you go with them, Futaba? Have fun. It's about time my regulars show up anyway. So I don't want you guys loitering around my store. <laughs> the fact that there were no damages due to the hacker's actions is but an afterthought. The issue I want to make clear is the attitude of the police, and more importantly, the government. <sighs> what do you mean? Are they doing their best to find an effective countermeasure against these phantom thieves? Is it not the government's duty to create a society where its citizens can live without worry? Unfortunately, the current cabinet is powerless. As such, they should be disbanded. I believe now is the time for me to risk my political career in hope of making a new reality. A new political system that goes beyond parties or factions. An ideal country of peace and order. This politician seems quite promising. He sounds insane. I have to agree. I hope he can work to ease the anxieties of the elderly. What do you think, boss? Hmm? Oh, sorry. Uh, I wasn't listening. Oh, I'm about to say, is it going to do that same thing again? <laughs> so the Phantom Thieves only stole the heart of Futaba Sakura, and Mejid was in turn defeated by her real-world hacking abilities? This does correlate to the facts as we know them. If he's telling the truth, then Wakaba Ishiki didn't commit suicide. Did a third party target her life with the goal of destroying her research? Wakaba's death was two years ago. That also coincides with when the incident started occurring. Does this other metaverse user that Matarame and Kaneshiro mentioned really exist? Earlier, I briefly mentioned about those psychotic breakdown incidents that have alarmed the public. 
All of a sudden, people will lose consciousness or become violent. A situation as incomprehensible as that can't be explained away as troubled social conditions. I suspect that these cases are all connected to a larger, man-made plot. The method involved always muddled the explication, but your story has virtually confirmed its viability. Although I wouldn't have expected a new criminal to come to light from your testimony. What did your group think of this other Metaverse user? A true criminal. We wanted this How man gone. How self-centered of you. The Phantom Thieves tamper with people's hearts without asking consent. How is that different? He kills people! We save lives! If you ask me, that's very different. You know, when we do it, nobody dies, and the world is happier. When he does it, people die, and the world is sadder. You feel me? Like, you feel like, it, 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 there's a big difference there, all right? Don't, don't hit me with your little, how is that different? There's a clear difference, all right? <laughs> well... No matter how you thought of them, there can be no doubting your resolve. Are those incidents because of you or someone else? Either way, I will get to the bottom of this. I don't talk about some dang right. how is that any different. Shut up. Now, let's move on to your next crime. Next Kunikazu crime. Kunikazu Okumura. You should know who he is, considering what happened. Your testimony regarding this incident will be serious. I'm sure you understand why. Answer my next question carefully. What did you do to this Okumura? To think, the cognitive version of a person would transform into such a horrible monster and attack us. That means our enemies aren't limited to shadows. I thought the other people were just victims. Like the slaves at the castle, or the walking ATMs. Even though they seem to be alive, they're only part of the backdrop. The environment. In other words, the palace ruler determines the form and strength of their cognitions. I would have loved to ask Futaba's mother how far along she was with her research. Research, huh? She was looking into that cognitive science stuff, yeah? If we put together all the information we've gathered up to this point, abuse of cognitive science can lead to death, and it may even relate to the psychotic breakdown incidents. Considering the cognitive aspect, I sense a strong connection between it and the metaverse. On top of that, the research might have been stolen and used by someone else. You mean those guys that showed Futaba-chan the fake suicide note? If that is the case, those people are unforgivable. Hey, Futaba. Is there anything else you can remember? Dang. She is quite difficult. That smell. Come on, no fair. Hey, can I snag a bite? Said no. Hey. Why don't we take a short break? I've been thinking, even if say, Utaba is a genius, could she really crush an international hacker organization that easily? The one who taunted the Phantom Thieves was a guy in Japan. I knew the Medjed members in Japan weren't anything special, so I wasn't worried. How do you know that? Because I'm the founder. Um... <laughs> What do you mean? Should we take that literally? Yep, it was only me at first, back when I was referred to as the hacker of justice. But since I stayed anonymous, a bunch of guys from all over the world started using the name. And those were the ones committing cyber crimes. It was a hassle to expose all of them, so I just left them be. Uh, so Futaba was the true Medjed, and we were freaking out over some weak-ass dipshits? You should have told us from the start, Futaba. I discarded the Medjed name a while ago. I'm Alibaba now. Futaba, what do you want to do now? Since you know our secret, we'd like you to join our team. Okay. <laughs> Just like that? Okay. This may even ensure our investigation of mementos goes along smoothly. Well, I guess. 
Well, Futaba's real amazing. She's gonna be a big help for us, huh? Say, Futaba, how did you find out about us? Secret. Oh. Where did you learn to hack? Secret. Private. Private. <laughs> when did you obtain the nav? I refuse to answer. Futaba-chan sure is unique. Still, it'll be a problem if she doesn't open up to us some more. At the very least, we need to be able to communicate normally with her. What should we do? Let's get to know her! How? First, we'll need to help her open up to us. If we each spend an entire day with her, maybe she'll get more used to being around us. I see. We do have the time thanks to summer vacation. We can begin tomorrow. Let's go to the beach! There'll be tons of people there. Plus, we got totally dried out in that desert. That's a great idea! I forgot I hadn't gone to the beach yet. Uh, excuse me. I'll come by tomorrow. See you then. Let me help as well. I don't have anything planned. You're Thanks. homeless, of course we you don't have plans. We can set a schedule with everyone else depending on when they're free. Okay! Can I really do this? Good luck! Why me? Stress is the enemy of beauty, you know. How can I stay calm about this? I understand how you feel. Thanks to the incident with those hackers, people are calling us incompetent. You are incompetent! all that, the Phantom Thieves are claiming justice is on their side. Don't make me laugh. Measured was dealt with by either the Phantom Thieves themselves or some avid supporter. There are no tracks whatsoever, so they must be quite skilled. Either way, the general public recognizes the Phantom Thieves as the subjugating party. They're gaining support and influence much faster than we could have anticipated. It is indeed an abnormal situation. I'm beginning to suspect mass manipulation of some kind. It's even possible that a powerful person is behind them, plotting the psychotic breakdowns. Now y'all just hating. Now y'all just hating. Now y'all just hating. Get the penis out your mouth. If only I had realized sooner. It's rare to hear you speak in that tone. For the sake of my justice, I won't forgive them. Talk talking about us on the train home. How awesome they think the Phantom Thieves are. Heard things too is becoming a huge topic of conversation. To be fair, the casualty from the Mad Jet attack would have been massive. It's no surprise they revere us for preventing it. Thanks to Alibaba, it was nothing. But ATMs and banks just stopping. That wasn't Mad Jet, was it? Separate, overreacting to mere coincidence. Either that or the rumors were never true to begin with. Talkative in these conversations. Is that so? I'll oh, shut up then. I'm pretty sure she's angry. You gotta apologize, Yusuke. Me? Why? <laughs> what is going on? It's really going to be okay. I'm worried about how things will be from now on. Be quiet, cat. <sighs> Training for top is gonna be a lot of work, more than stealing someone's heart. I doubt she can fight. Do they pull it off? Prove the justice to the fan of thieves. You may be right. Even the guys who've been criticizing them have to accept them now. No spreading like wildfire. Extra boost on my Why side. Why is he of all people getting excited about this? Because he's our well, number one meat really sucker. really did draw a lot of attention. I can't wait to see what happens. I'll just add this. That's an episode. That's an episode, guys. Y'all enjoy it. Like, subscribe, leave a comment, and read them all. Tap into the next one. We done uh stop med jet. We did things, other things, and did more things and things that other did other things. You feel me? 
So now, I hope y'all enjoy, and we gonna see what happened next time.